Hello, this is Ron, and uh, this is my second uh, painting behind the scenes, part two of three of my coastal sunset. So we're finishing up the sky. Hopefully you've seen my first one, and hopefully these help you out. Uh, in the future, I will be doing more paintings, so I hope that these will help you in uh, your learning, or if you just want to see how it's done, either way, um, hopefully they're helpful videos. So here I'm just um, using a one inch flat brush and just taking some white for the clouds and kind of smearing the, uh, kind of dabbing and twisting the brush and then coming back with a sort of a blending technique and just lightly swiping the sky to uh, form the clouds. Mostly using a one inch flat brush and a blending brush on this video. It's kind of blending, a lot of blending, just lightly touching the surface while the paint is still wet. This whole painting was done with wet on wet, and oil paint takes three days to a week, really about a week to really dry good. But that's what I like about it, because it gives you time to stop and come back and, uh, you know, still work with your paint and work it in within a day or two you don't want to come back three or four days later and try to do something I mean it depends on what you're doing if you're just adding a layer but typically you want to work all this stuff in while it's wet Back down on the sunset area, just again blending some of the orange and reds and whites. As you can see on the, the completed product on the left, it comes out real nice once you work it the right way. I'm down, uh, I'm going to start on the ocean area trying to fine-tune my ocean line there and before I start putting my blue paint down here goes the blue Sometimes it's hard to get a really nice straight line, but I'm working on it. Lots of blue, getting the blue down at the base all the way down to the bottom of the canvas. 
and then kind of like the sky I'll come back and, and do some blending before I start adding some waves as it gets closer to the little shoreline that I created. Spraying some paint thinner. Canvas gets a little dry so it helps me with my painting when I have the canvas a little bit damp. And it goes faster. Just about got all the blue area, ocean area covered up. of a base coating to work with. And I'm drawing out my little land area, my beach area. Just kind of a base point here to get the layout of it and then I'll start blending in the right colors a little bit later. Speeding up the video a little bit, you can still see the details being done. This way it doesn't drag through so long. Switch back over to the uh, ocean area and adding some depth to the ocean waters, a little different colors, a little darker in the deeper areas and then you'll see, not in this video, but next one I'll be adding some, some blue-green water along the shoreline just where the, where the ocean's more shallow. Adding a little darker blue out there and then I'll add some lighter shades as well so it'll end up looking kind of like the sun shining across the waters. Thank you again for watching and uh, hopefully these videos have been an asset to you. Please let me know your opinion and see you next time.